So there's this worry in people's minds that their internet activity is being constantly mined or spied on by the NSA, their employer, or their internet service provider. And while some of these concerns might be very well founded, it's important to not forget the low-tech but no less effective method of snooping that is watching directly over your shoulder. And while this might sound a little silly, Many of us have to deal with this when we're using our computers or devices in environments where we can't get a lot of privacy. Roommates, nosy coworkers, or that weirdly sweaty person next to you on your economy class flight can all too often see what's happening on your screen way too easily. I mean, better viewing angles is like a selling point, right? This is where a privacy filter can be a great investment. The basic idea behind them is to severely restrict viewing angles to the point where you essentially have to be looking at the screen dead on in order to see it. You've probably seen them at the bank if you've ever tried to peek at your account balance while the teller is off getting your cash. But how do they work? Well, think of a window in your house with vertical blinds. If you don't have one, pretend you do. If you turn them so they're completely open, you can see outside fairly easily. But if you stand off to the side, the surface area of the blinds will obscure the windows enough to where you can barely see past them at all. Well, privacy filters work similarly, just on a much, much smaller scale. Some manufacturers refer to their technology as micro louver, as they use the thinness of each individual blind as a selling point. The thinner the blinds, the more light can pass through for the intended user. A typical filter can contain thousands of these blinds to enhance privacy while still making the screen relatively easy to see for whoever's right in front of it. Typically, the filter will start to block out screen contents once someone is looking at the display from an angle of about 30 degrees. Now, although most people buy these filters as an aftermarket add-on for their computer or monitor, we're actually starting to see screens with the technology built in, including, and this is pretty cool, the ability to turn the filter on or off. Because even from the front, a privacy filter does make the screen a little harder to see, just like looking out a window through completely open blinds still isn't the same as having a window with nothing at all on it. So this is a welcome change if you've ever wanted to watch a movie with the, I don't know, not so sweaty neighbor on the plane, which is cool. But what if you're doing some super important like James Bond level stuff on your computer where a standard privacy filter just won't cut it? There's actually a way to make your screen appear blank to anyone who isn't wearing a special pair of glasses. You see, modern LCD screens use polarizing filters to orient the light waves a certain way so that they come out of the screen as actual useful images or text. Without that filter, light would just come out of the monitor like blah, and it would be this incoherent mixture and end up appearing just plain white. So some intrepid do-it-yourselfers have created their own privacy monitors by opening up their displays, removing the polarizing filter, and then cutting out pieces of it small enough to fit into eyeglass frames. The result is that you have a monitor that will always look plain white unless you're wearing the special specs, which will reveal what's on screen. We actually even have a tutorial on how to do this on our other channel right about here. And while you shouldn't do this on a screen that you're using for gaming or other tasks where visual quality really matters, it's perfect if you're working on a super secret business proposal, have family members that can't keep their eyes off your monitor, or just don't want your boss knowing what you're really doing during work hours. If you've been watching Tech Quickie for any reasonable period of time, you've probably heard of Dollar Shave Club. But what is possible that you don't know is that Dollar Shave Club not only has great razors available at a fraction of the cost of what you'd pay, which is remarkable when you consider that they actually deliver it to you rather than you having to go somewhere and go pick it up, but that they also have other bathroom products, including hair products, more face products. I mean, technically a razor is sort of a face product, but they also have their Dr. Carver shave butter as well as their aftershave and even products for your butt. So everything all the way from the top of your head to the, it's not quite really quite the bottom of your bottom, but it's certainly like the sort of bottomest part of your bottom can look and smell like a million bucks. Join the club. Once you're in the club, you'll see they've got the best grooming products on the market and they are affordable.
So right now is your chance to see for yourself why so many people love Dollar Shave Club. If you're not a member yet, and you've never joined, now's the time. You'll get your first month of razors for absolutely free. All you gotta do is pay the shipping, and after that, it's only a few bucks a month to keep that train rolling. It's a limited time offer though, so join today. Go to dollarshaveclub.com slash Linus, which we have linked in the video description. That's dollarshaveclub.com slash Linus. So thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, like it. If you disliked it, dislike it. If you wanna check out our other channels, Boom, you can do that right over there. If you want to leave a comment with suggestions for future fastest possibles, boom, you can do that below. And if you want to subscribe and follow, then boom. Nothing, I got nothing, boom.